Okay. Tower stairs, it's time to grind out some XP. We went from the fortress to Althena's tower. Okay, where are the enemies and where's the treasure? We've got the urgent music, but... I'll have to go back the other way. Check this out. I really could have had done without Jessica using that Saint Litney thing with Davis. Okay, cool. We need more live alls, and we've got to figure out who drops the, the uh, items we need. And then we're going to have to grind out item drops. colors are there. There's red. I saw black over there and blue. Huh. I already hit white. We could try the Order of the Dragons. The order we saw the dragons in. Sure. Alright, that'd be red, blue, black. happen? No? Welcome to the blessed tower of the goddess, mighty dragon master. Think back and recall how you met each of the four dragons. Your memories of those encounters are required to successfully navigate the tower. Oh, there's a teleporter here. Looks like it's on.
Alright, Nash at 45. Two agility. Alright, wisdom. Only two. Three magic endurance. Like I said, that's gonna be an important stat. It's Cousin Cheeto of Milk Toast Gaming. What's up, buddy? Thanks for being here. Does my boss even have any hit points left now? My height boss. Huh? Nice. Ziggy Pigster killed my height boss. That's awesome. will take the teleporter. Oh, it even has the solution right there. White, red, blue, black as you come in through the door. Okay. White. Red. Black. Now we work. Blue dragon helmet, black dragon armor, red dragon shield, white dragon wings. Remember the foregoing, for they shall lead you to the core of Althena's tower. So you missed, like, one of the most boring hours of Major Rage TV ever, or one of the best hours of Major Rage TV ever, depending on your point of view. I got absolutely stomped several times by the boss. Check this out! Then C764 came along and reminded me that I need to change my formation, and... Then I moved my characters around and I stopped getting absolutely trucked by the all attack. Or I turned a line attack into not an all attack by just physically attacking for two of my wrath ring. Plus, more importantly, an angel's tear from that fight. These grindable guys have angel's tears. Alright, so we've identified the ones with angel tears big statue stone guys. Oh, I wanted to check out the Wrath Ring and I want to change my formation. Check this out. Out. All right, we're gonna cool it on the usage of the spells just in case I can't go back down to that statue. 
because I just thought about it a little bit. I might not be able to take these teleporters back the other way. Existential one, greetings and salutations to you as well. Thank you for dropping by the stream. What are you going to be playing this evening? More Helldivers or more Jedi Outcast? Red alert, indeed, it is Milktoast Gaming in the house. Knock these guys around a bit. These guys aren't nearly as hard as the ones when I was cursed. Another free angels tier to replace everything I used. More tails. You beat Jedi Survivor and moved on. Oh, and Shrouded. Nice. How is it? I saw Zaryu was playing that at one point. He's back on Season of Discovery now. But how is it Shrouded? Blizzard. Darn it. Check this out. Oh, nice. Old school Tomb Raider did have a very chill vibe to it. Nice. Okay. Awesome. Well. But thanks again for dropping by, it's always good to see you. Okay, when left alone to their own devices, these guys absolutely truck. Good to know. Can't play around with them too much. They're gonna kill my Dragon Master. <laughs> made it out of this one again. Alright. Did I go back and make another run of it? Hey look, it's our friend. But the good news is we can get back down. Bad news is I forgot to heal. And I still haven't done my uh, formation. Check this out. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I might move I might do that after I get done with Elden Ring. I'm near, nearing the end of that. I plowed through that. You don't even want to know what my blade on that one is. Another Angel's Tear. Epic. Now we just need to find something that'll drop starlights. There is no run button, Mike. doesn't hurt to save. I mean, after all, the motto of the channel is save early, save often. The big lizard dude's in the tower proper. Okay. After this heal, we'll move on to proper tower. No, you move on. You get, you get things done efficiently. Let's see. Beating the game at level 42. Not stopping to farm anything. You'd level up. Like, I accidentally went to. I forgot that I would, wouldn't be able to do anything after the grindery 
and went to the grindery without doing uh, the spring first. I never did the girl spring. This time it's blue, black, red, uh... It's blue, black, hey! Yeah, it's a big oof. I've got to do source record for uh, the topic video I'm gonna make, so I'm going to do everything on that. I'm just gonna go. I'm gonna go to archive.org and pull up the guide that I had, but couldn't find my physical copy of. Not sword dance. I just want to attack. I'm gonna use Nash's MP, her MP. Leave the boss killers Check alone. This out. But no, go back, do some source record, take it slow, do all the content, not miss anything, have a much easier time having powerful accessories that I've missed out on. Like the extra attack and such. I believe you get from the Elder of Lawn Village. Oh, didn't realize these guys had a paralyze. Alright, we'll take him out. Okay, we've got to do the formation and I've got to heal Nash. Thank you. Okay, he's good. Ah, that's a lot of them. Wheel flash cut. Yeah, no, they go before Mia goes. Check this out. And yes, indeed, existential one said, "Check this out." Lightning bolt emojis. I can't believe I missed that. That was great. Yeah. That's one way to handle it. Hey, there's 45 for Mia and Jess. Hopefully. Big 6 MP gain, nice. She snuck up and ended up with over 300 MP without me paying attention and noticing. Wow! Hey, she got a little bit of range to run away. Because she's definitely not going towards any enemies. Too. Nice. Now she is going towards enemies. Oh, 
Okay, it said blue, black, red, white that time. It went backwards. Well, kind of backwards. Black was last. some of that Check fancy new out. range of Jesses to attack the guy way up there. I was hoping Kyle would go before Alex. That messes up my plan. Both hits were crits. Nice. Summon elemental power. Sick critties. Oh no, Mia! She's like the mascot character, the the shy, quiet one. <laughs> I forget the name of the uh, anime trope, but that. Fits, but it's totally an anime trope. Most of them are all anime tropes. Two angels' tears that time. Oh, what was that? Ring. Okay. No, there was something else we got to. Was it a Sage's Robe? We just got a Sage's Robe a little bit ago. Detonator Armlet, that was it. Althena's Armlet. completely freaking out about how few tears we have now. Did it just make a bad noise? Oh, it's not gonna give me the clue again? I accidentally, the A button stuck and I accidentally went through it way too fast and didn't read it. So I might have it wrong. I must have it wrong. I thought it was blue, black, red, white. It must be blue, red, black, white. Because I know white was the last one. They really like paralyzing Kyle. Summon elemental power. And they like sm stomping on Mio. Check this out. I'm just gonna end this fight instead of healing and prolonging the pain. 
Excellent. Alice will clean up the mess. this again. sword and we got to equip this the uh, spooky armlet we'll just we'll assume that that's what it meant out the defense for the attack because we are insane. Next clue, smashing through the white ice, sprinting through red flames, swimming through the blue water, something the black earth. This is the road that awaits the brave adventurer who wishes to behold the goddess Althena. Okay, so, welcome back. This time the order is the order we saw the dragons in and just gave us in this poetic journey type metaphor the clue. Then check it out now. Flash cut just for one shots, the big guys. If I didn't need to get deeper in and farm the starlights, I would just stay in the first area and go back and forth between them and the goddess statue. But right now I've got to get to the white. Switch. I'll clear out the enemies and then try to solve the puzzle. Out. 
Yeah, she's getting it done. Attack cleric activate. Yeah, that should take no dang it. Ow. Summon elemental power. Oh, bye, Kyle. Hey, there we go. We're leveling up again. The dangerous thing is he's going to get a little stronger every time Alex levels up for some inexplicable reason. Makes the game more challenging, though. Okay, why isn't that switch active yet, though? Oh, God. Check this out. The, the art on the uh, insane sword looks cool. Not as cool as Althena's sword, but almost. This should do it. This should finish them off. This one we won't take any more damage. Another Wrath Ring. Another Angel's Tear. Kyle leveled up. Four hit points, two magic points, two attack. Nice. Two defense. Excellent. Agility. We could use a little way more of that. Though. Speaking of agility, I think I'm about to trade out his speed tail for uh, a wrath ring.
give it to Mia. Give it to Nash, doesn't need to be faster. Nash does need to get rid of that goofy accessory and get something real on, though. a pair of elements the thunder and fire or the defense and water and wind what are you thinking chat any thoughts I would do thunder and fire Give chat a minute to see if anybody's got a suggestion. Seems like that, that's a negative ghost rider. I'll go with your suggestion. Nice, it's 10 attack and 1 defense. I mean, it, it doesn't matter a whole lot. We're about to face a master of elemental magic uh, as the end boss. Who's just... Okay. So as great as that is, we need other stuff more right now. their healing nuts back. Okay. It's active. That choice doesn't matter too much, but having some protection against some elements will be better than Nash just taking the full brunt of all elemental attacks for the sake of having a joke accessory on. It's just like even though when Bearded Man Thing said he didn't want his character to wear clothes, I eventually put on body armor back on Gus. But by then the damage was done, he had zero evasion, but he'd just been taking so much damage that he had a ridiculous amount of hit points. And now I'm facing things that do damage based on your hit points, and so I just have that many more hit points to have to heal on him, and it's going through all my ethers and magic points. <laughs> I'm, I'm starting to doubt my ability to complete Pandemonium in one go. I might have to see about leaving, but if I'm going to leave, I've got to leave like right where I stopped last night. We didn't end up beating it. We had to call it. It got to be one o'clock our time. It was just nah. All right, Nash is 46 now. I didn't pay too much attention to his gains. He didn't get much wisdom or magic endurance. Hopefully he got a good deal of MP.
was lit up. up. open up and did a bridge. Does anybody need healed? It's not enough. I don't want to use the MP over 54 hit points. Music change. Oh wow, another statue. And the teleporter to go back if I decide I want more uh, angel tears. But I think we're good on them. Yeah. Hey, there's more of these ring horn guys anyways. Now there's stone creep. Check this out. We're gonna go nuts on clearing this room because we can just top off. That was anticlimactic. Ah, the stone creeps are resistant to sword techs. They'll probably be weak to some sort of elemental magic. Probably ice. And I've got her casting fire. By the power of Althena! This is gonna have to use a miracle with me. Or whatever the all heal is. Well, Flamaria got it done, Jeebus. Others. Yep. And Saint Check Litany just out. because. Althena, lend me your power. Nice, refreshing tea. I have to take them out the old-fashioned way. Glad I still had Kyle do something big. I figured explosion damage would do good damage. The explosion staff. Explosion damage would do good damage. Okay, I think we're out of puzzles. I think we just got good old fashioned fight now. Muted poor Kyle. Not brother Kyle. By the power of Althena. Yup.
Come on. Get in between them. There you go. Mia. Oh. I jinxed it. I flip and jinxed it. Fine, you know what? You want to get in there so bad and attack them, Mia? Go attack them. I'm not going to stop you. I will heal you so you don't get got. Althena, lend me your power! And I have to heal her eventually anyways. Jeez. Over half her health in one shot. Other direction. Yep. I mean, I'm not super worried about it. I'm trying to train after all. See if these guys drop the starlights. Hey, it's the. I think these are the ones that. Uh. That, says, that C means. Ultra Fiend. Yeah, hey, I bet he is big and that. I bet he is nasty. He's definitely big. Check this out. He's resistant to magic. Althena, lend me your power. Yeah. And Sortex. What about explosion staff damage? I wonder. In the name of the goddess, this is intense. This is a final dungeon. Drop the item. Uh. Everybody's good, everybody's good. We want to fight you. Give us your stuff. Give us your stuff. Out. 
I'm thinking level 47. Level 47 sounds good to me. And then just try to cheese it straight to him. Oh, I'm forgetting somebody. Zenobia. Big sis. Check this out. He'll surely stand in my way. So I'm gonna have to take her down. Then go back to the statue and heal up. And pray I don't have to use too many items. We're gonna have plenty of angels tears. Here's Mia 46. Give more agility, dang it. I'm loath to do this on screen, but I've got to grind a little bit. I at least hope I get these item drops I need. Worst case scenario, I don't get the drops and I just get the higher levels and it'll give me a little bit easier time dealing. Did it give you a warning about the ad or no? I didn't get the warning about the ad. No, it just, it just pops the ad. Check this out. Am I back? Yep. And Jess. And Jess. And Alex. I might as well have just used a calm litany, but I was planning on doing this number anyways. I want to grind after I deal with the boss. What's the spirit talisman do? Halves all attacks. Who do we want that on? Jess? Probably, yeah. Instead She's of Watt. Yeah, instead of Watt, though. I guess the refresher ring, because the conditions. Yeah. Two defense, it says. We're 
three, five, seven, eight, ten. I've only got ten silver lights. I actually think I want to cheese it to the box at full. As full as I possibly can be. Yeah. Try to take out these uh, stone guys and no paralysis. This mute's gonna be a problem though. Hey, it didn't happen. I jinxed it for him. That's nuts. Did you see that? What's he getting ready to do? Something bad. Kyle can't. prep for it. That wrath ring is working out for Kyle. Just insta-death. Yep! Are they taking decent damage from Thunder Thrust or no? We should take him down this turn. Not with hits like that. Come on, Alex. I wish I had that number of attack up so I could give it to Kyle with that wrath ring. Okay, he's charging the impression. We've got to take him down. Every point of damage. Yes. Almost not. Hey, Starlight. Excellent. Past him. Check 
Check this out. 80. It's not beats not doing anything with his bow. Sure. Nice crit. Go for it, Kyle. You could do this, buddy. Hard carry. He missed. Does he just piss pick a random spot on the ground? He's getting ready to do his lightning move. The lightning move isn't that dangerous. Did she just do 60 damage with her melee? Yep. That is more than the swords. Up, oh, I'm gonna have to beat him for the bridge to come back, probably. Alright, let's see how this works out. Yeah. I'm gonna have to split this up. I knew it was gonna go long, but... I figured I'd at least have Zenobia down already. Nash. Or Nash dodge it. Excellent. How about this one? Yeah. That's what's up. Another angel's tear to make up for that one I had to use a little while ago. Jess needs to heal, right? Yes! That's oh, just a switch. Ooh, a silver light in the chest. Awesome. Conservation mode. But we're not getting the kind of starlight drops we need. Ow. 
By the power of Athena. Please, yeah, get the group ones. Can we make it? No. Excellent. Way to go, Nash. Yeah, knock him closer to Kyle. That's what's up. Haha, <laughs> dodged it. Rathering crit. Okay, win the day. Alright, 47. Three attack. Yeah, let's go. Anybody else? Nope, not this time. Check this out. Finishing them off. Bad and clean up. Devil pendant. What does that do? I don't know. There's Kyle's level 47. He and Alex are the only two who didn't get removed from play in Act 3 at some point for some reason. They all go the same place, it looks like. Oh, another silver light. Sweet deal. Okay, on MP. How are we on? Try to take this guy out as fast as possible. Also, try to get people less clumped up. Yeah! Also, we'll get rid of those guys in one fell swoop. I can commit one silver light to topping Alex back off. By the power of Athena! They all 
always kill Alex? Yeah, no, he doesn't like Alex at all. <laughs> he identified the biggest threat on this battlefield. Oh, I didn't check out the devil pendant. It's Kyle this time. Oh, he marks the spot on the ground with the little skull. He's doing it again. Nice crit. Way to end it, Jess. Agro Priestess. She's like Maria in Final Fantasy II. Doing crazy damage with the staffs. Alright, Nash is leveled up. What about Mia, maybe? They missed about the same amount of XP between him running off and being a sniveling coward and her getting damseled in the village. Oh, got different music. Do I get a chance to save? Yes. Okay, it's a different location now. It says on Galleon's Trail. There's Zenobia. This is it, Zenobia. No more running away. No more stays of execution. Today is the day I wipe you from existence. Such bloodthirsty passion from the foolish little girl. Your words and the words of your miserable father have no meaning to me. My only care and desire is for the affections of Galleon. Dear sweet Galleon. He is the only being capable of saving this world from chaos. Galleon doesn't care about you or this world. He cares only about power and control. And what's wrong with that, you adolescent ingrates? Galleon's strength is what makes him so... attractive as a leader. The only thing Galleon is leading us into is slavery. And I'd sooner die than have someone tell me what I can and cannot do with my life. Galleon's bloodlust is a turn for the worse. Not better. Oh, wow. Topical. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. We don't need a god or goddess dictating our every move. We have each other to rely on. You... You're talking nonsense. How dare you doubt the wisdom of Lord Galleon. This is what happens to the children of the world without someone to guide them. My father was my guide. Which... And I'll use the skills he taught me to expose the inferiority of your ways. Ha! I've had my fill of your foolish delusions. The time is at hand for me to bury you eternally in the abyss of doubt and regret. What's happening? Ha ha ha! Your own dark doubts and desires shall be your most cruel executioner. Farewell, miserable children. Welcome to the battle in the center of the mind trope. What? We got a mindscape? Where am I? Who are you? I am what you fear most. I am you. What? That's right, Jessica. I am the real you. The one you keep hidden deep inside. What do you want from me? I want what you want, Kyle. We are one, remember? I want us to stop trying to fight this useless battle. We know Galleon's unbeatable, don't we? Yes! Admit it! I... I don't... Come on, Kyle! You can lie to other people, but you can't lie to yourself. 
All we want to do is have fun and imbibe the sweet nectar of womankind. You know it's true. It's all we've ever wanted. Do we care about the fate of the world? Hell no! We just want to squeeze in as much merrymaking as we can before the final cur- Maybe before. So, let's get back to Nanza where we can eat, drink, and be disgustingly promiscuous. Our destiny awaits. Who next? Mia. We hate the responsibility that's been placed upon us by everyone. Because we've never had confidence in ourselves. Ellipses of doubt. Everyone assumes that we're going to lead the Magic Guild. That we want to follow in our mother's footsteps. But does anyone care about what we want, Mia? Has anyone ever cared? Of course not. No one knows how. How weak we really are. Too scared to be a leader. Too weak to fight. You have to agree with me, Nash. Because you are me. We know about leadership. We know that strong people are needed to guide weak ones. We see it every day at the Magic Guild, under the guise of teaching. And we know that we're one of the strong ones. We're a shepherd, not a sheep. Ellipses. Why do you continue to hesitate? Galleon himself has acknowledged our power. We must join with him again and help Galleon rule our world as our new god. Think of the power he'll grant us, Nash. People will kneel in our presence. It's what we've always desired, Nash. And now it is within our grasp. Father has never really tried to understand us, Jessica. He's always forced us to live our life his way, to fulfill his dreams. What about the life we always wanted, Jessica? What about our dreams? No one understands the real us, Jessica. Ellipses of doubt. So why should we fight for them when all they've ever done is hold us back? Sip a little tea. Oh dear, even Alex, here in the belly of the beast. Luna has abandoned us. That's not true! Luna has made her decision, and she chose Galleon. That's not true! Of course she'd choose him, Alex. He awakened the power within her. And Luna's soul was forever extinguished when Althena's was revived. The girl we grew up with is no more. Luna isn't dead! We must accept facts, Alex. She may appear to be Luna, but she's actually the goddess Althena. And the goddess has no use for weak mortals like us. Ellipses. Now that Luna is dead, we no longer have a reason to fight. In your heart, you know it to be true. Right, they're just delusions. My dad has never forced me to do anything, not once. And I've never had to hide who I am from him. When I'm outside, I run wild and free. And when I'm inside, I behave as a lady should. My father was a pirate, and my mother a noblewoman. I've inherited the blood of both my beloved parents. My father understands this, and so do my friends. No one has ever held me back from being myself. Yeah, I like to have fun. Okay, I love to have fun. But this adventure has taught me that there are times when I have to get serious. And there's nothing more serious than what's going on here right now. Besides, it's gonna be hard to have fun when the world's been destroyed. 
I have to fight so that future generations are free to freeload. All my life, I've allowed fear to control me. I was always afraid that my mother would consider me a failure. Always afraid that I wasn't good enough or strong enough to lead the Magic Guild. But I realized that my fear wasn't only affecting myself. If I couldn't face my fear, other people would be hurt. So I've resolved to be strong, not just for myself, but for the people I care about. And for those that care about me. Cheeto, take Kyle's motto. Be free to freeload in 2024. We can't. We can't value. I, I'm sorry. This is this is hard for me to admit. All right, let me try again. We can't value people only for their power or wealth. We have to value people for all they have to offer. And when we work together, we can achieve anything. Together, my friends and I shall defeat Galleon absolutely. Well, you managed to escape the maze of your wretched inner selves. All of you except for the Dragon Master, that is. HA! Don't worry about Alex. He'll break free of your feeble magic. He is the strongest one among us. He'll never give up until he rescues Luna, you hag. Alex draws strength from the faith we have in him. And I draw strength from knowing how hard he's gonna kick your whiny butt. Luna! You fool. Haven't you heard a word we said? Luna is beyond your reach. If we try to pursue her, we'll be killed as well. Don't you dare stand in my way, Alex. That's right, Alex. She betrayed us, so just leave her. Luna! Run away! It's not important anymore! Luna! Luna betrayed us. If you stay here, you'll be killed. Go now. Get out of here, Alex. Run away before it's too late for both of us. I won't run away until I save her. No matter what it takes, no matter how far, I will save her. you are, Alex. We were just telling Zenobia here that it won't matter if she begs you for mercy. To hell with you, Alex! To hell with all of you! We all know Luna as a human being, Zenobia. Not the creature the Galleon is trying to turn her into. I will give up my life to save her from him. I know that Luna still lives inside the body of the goddess. Just as the goddess lived inside of her. They are one and the same. I will drown those meddling brats in their own blood, Magic Emperor. I swear it. I shall not concede defeat to these snot-nosed infidels. Well then. Why didn't Alex get full healed? That's kind of BS. Get Saint Litany up. Athena, lend me your power! Hey, Mia broke 200 hit points. Cool! Your time has run out.
Check this out. I'm not gonna play. By the power of Althina! Ignore like Silver Star Story Dragon Quarter. Rest don't replenish HP. I mean, it's pretty generous. They just, we had a battle at the center of the mind and it restored our health for some reason. That's pretty, that's pretty cool. I shouldn't gripe just because I was already willing to use a silver light on him anyways. Check this out. They could have spread. I'm not gonna jinx it. I'm not gonna say anything yet. I'm just gonna be grateful that I'm not, like, getting Raffle stomped constantly. Hit her with the Altina Litany. Top her off. Spread the love this time. Check this out. Althina, lend me your power. Your time has run out. Ouch, somebody's about to get one-shotted, probably. Nope. Cool. We're just gonna calm Litany and keep it moving. Check this out. Althena, lend me your power! They didn't make the boss fight super crazy hard after a super long scene. I say that now. By the power of Alfina. Knock on wood. Pray I don't Your jinx myself. Time has run out. I don't have condition cure items on. she getting ready to do. I don't like the look of that. Looks like she's charging up something big. By the power of Althina. Your time has run out. That again. I wish you could move and act in the same turn.
Your time has run out. I had to jinx it, indeed. got to be getting close though your time has run out or a shot's not that bad tell mom I'll go tell mom I'll take a break and put her to bed after this after this boss fight just gonna leave Nash down. By the power of Athena. Your time has run out. Finish her off. Your time has run out. Check this out. Oh, yeah, I saw that fight. Chaos had it in for Izzy for sure. <laughs> I was like, take this, you noob. Althena, lend me your power! By the power of Althena. Your time has run out. If I had known about the uh, stone uh, status ailment, I would have uh, put on some of those. I don't think I have anything that cures that other than the uh, cleanse spell. I don't have time to do that. Get as much damage as she's doing. Yes! Alice's this party won the battle, got 55,000 XP, got a silver light to replace the one I used in the fight. Mia leveled up to 47, Jess stood too. While we do this scroll, I'm gonna go move my mom's oxygen. No, this can't be. Oh, Galleon always told me that humans were ugly and 
weak. It's impossible. Galleon could never be wrong. I failed you, my lord. Please, forgive me. Did you hear the way she spoke Galleon's name? It almost sounded as though she was in love with him. What a pitiful woman. 